I'm Tina. Hello, I'm Gilbert. And this is our Edsite Think Lab. This is where the kids work. Um, we, we chose nice furniture so it, they can work in nice groups. And it's like comfortable so then they can really think about what they're doing. And this group right now is working on a prototype. Video TV and we use it to showcase our work. We all, we also use it so we so our teacher puts up some um, keynotes where she tells us what we need to do. As you can see right now, um, this is what some of the students around us are doing. So we have to make a design statement and draw a step and put some notes in our video. These are little things I'm trying to make. So it can help us on our design thinking. And here's an example of uh, so we made this to we had to figure out some needs. So this is a grandpa, an old man who is achy and sometimes a bit grouchy. And she has trouble getting around so she has to walk in a crane. She also has difficult getting into and out of his chair. Though he sits his chair most of the day. So then this group tried to make a chair that's fit. Yeah. The, five games, the top five games we play, the majority of our class plays. So the first one is YouTube, and second one is Minecraft. Third one we play is Clash of Clans. The fourth one most of us play is Geometry Dash. And the fifth one is Frib.com. See, here is we, we, we started to uh, get the games that we played, and we put them in little groups on of their of the of their own. So it's the reason why we play the game. We have adventure, social, addictive, uh, creative and that we try to put them in a little pile of their own so you can see it different groups. And my name is Elena and the first prototype we built was uh, for our kindergartners to learn their ABC. Our game is called Cash Dog Fishes and basically what you do is throw fishes swimming in a pool of water. Hi guys, my name is Freddie. And in the first week of the, our internship we learned about the, the design thinking cycle. The first one was dreaming and the second one is designing. And the third one is doing. My name is Liana. My name is Kevin. And here at Captain Smith we always start off we always start off our projects with a driving question. Our driving question is, using design thinking, how can we help EdSci become a better website for students and teachers? Captain Smith, we come up with need to knows. One of our need to knows are what do kids want from EdSci? And another is what is design thinking? We, how can we improve EdSci? And what is EdSci? What do they do? How can parents use that site? What do teachers want from that site? I'm going to ask part of our research to make that site more engaging. We looked up fe features on popular learning sites. With some sites that we searched of IXL, Starfall, Quizlet, and Fur our schedule. But now it's a snack bar. This is where we get snacks at the end of the day. And we've been thinking about how to how websites are very successful. Usually the ones that are have little expression, gaming, adventure, and so we also they also most of them like they have immediate feedback. Accessible and simple, easy to use, and challenging. Right now we're working on our prototypes of how to make EdSight more engaging. Some of our ideas. 